Starting with breaking news, thousands of customers have lost Cox Internet and phone service for hours today. We've had dozens of phone calls and emails from viewers. The outage has been across several parishes in southeast Louisiana and even into other states. Take a look at this map marking the outages on the website downdetector.com. The areas in red and yellow outline just how far those outages go. Jacqueline Quinn is following the story and joins us live with how the outage is impacting people and businesses. Jacqueline? Yeah, I'm standing out here at the Cox store near Elysian Fields right now, where it's been a steady stream of customers coming into the store right now, complaining about some of their issues, including not being able to call 911. In fact, people have been coming up here talking to us, but I've been traveling around, and early I was in the French Quarter where I talked with some of the business owners there, and they tell me, to borrow an expression from somebody there, that business is as slow as molasses because most people use credit card, and that what's not slow is frustrations and tempers building up over this ordeal. Signs at some businesses say they are open, but inside some are struggling to keep things rolling as a Cox Internet outage prevents customers from being able to use plastic and many other things. Oh, they just said that the Internet was down and that they're not able to take credit cards, so everything's cash only. Cox says the outage started around 1.30 this afternoon. Yeah, I mean, we're kind of, we are stuck right now. We, we don't have any control over this. From restaurants unable to take orders online and in person. What would you tell Cox right now? I wish we had some competition in this town. To stores losing sales. One lady, she said she might come back. That She came back. The other lady, she said hold it. The other lady, like, I have the stuff right here. Many of the workers around the French Quarter say they are suffering, just as some cashless customers say this is a huge inconvenience. If it lasts all weekend while we're visiting, it'll, it'll impact us. Now, I walked into the store earlier and the managers told me that they are working on this problem. Corporate Cox told me that they're investigating the started around 1.30 and it's all over New Orleans. We've also heard that it's all over the United States at this point. We'll have more coming up for now reporting near Elysian Fields. Jacqueline Quinn, Eyewitness News.